I never uh, considered baking as like one of my future plans, but during that process, um, I I decided I was gonna go for it and do an alternative bakery, right? So like start with gluten-free, sugar-free, dairy-free, uh, all because of family members that I have. It started like with my mom got diabetes and then we love sweets, you know, so I wanted something to do for her. And I found this random book called Gluten-Free, Sugar-Free Baking. I didn't pick it up for the gluten-free part, I picked it up for the sugar-free part. And so anyways, during that, this process, I would say the whole process of the health makeover, um, I don't know, I, I guess I went within, right? You kind of go within yourself and learn about yourself. And I realized I was going to go for it and I was going to give it a try. So I started my business, uh, originally intending it to be a bakery, an alternative bakery. It didn't quite work out, um, but the plan has deviated where now I'm doing baking mixes. And it's kind of come full circle because I did like the gluten-free stuff and then now I'm doing paleo baking mixes. And the paleo diet is very low glycemic. It helps people that have diabetes, it helps people that have a gluten intolerance, it helps people that have a dairy intolerance. Like there's so many people that could be uh, benefit from it. So uh, I decided to sell my recipes in a bag. So the baking mixes that people can make at home. And um, I just got a huge, huge, um, offer and uh, start of the negotiations with Sprout, Sprouts Grocery Store um, to for they want to carry my product. Um, so I'm super excited about working that out. And, yeah, um, and she, yeah. she, that vision came to her out of um, Vision Quest yeah. to, be, to do... And it's on my board. I still have my... She made a vision board. I have my vision board at home. I don't know. It's really special. So, yeah. And I love to bake. So now, now with my paleo um, baking mix, I think it's perfect. Cause it's she like, makes nut nut uh, cake. Mm. It's delicious and coconut frosting. Mm. Yeah. With the a non-sugar frosting is unbelievable. No. <laughs> I'm trying to find a oh. co-packer uh, that can do my frostings because the people that are going to manufacture my baking mixes can't do the frosting. I've been There's looking no everywhere. Material. Yeah, it's just different nice. process. Mm. No, no, that's so fine. It's just a different process, but I can't find a manufacturer that can do it for me. I really need that. Really? <laughs> You're yeah. going to find them. I need you to find someone. You will. It's mm -hmm. hard to find. How do you find it? Yeah, it's really hard. Yeah. I've been 